Hey guys, it's Heath Winner. Welcome back. Uh, we are gonna do another Let's Play. I this is my fourth take for this. Um, the others were either I put the quality way too high, um, or I have to like edit the video and it like was a total disaster, or. Or my controls weren't working the right way I wanted them, but I changed them, so. Anyway, let's go to Yoshi's Island 1. As you can see, Cooper without the shell. And, oh crap. Okay. I have all my stuff set up. Let's just do that. Bullet build. Okay, so, let's just, oh wait, no, the mushrooms are here. I love the music in this game. I almost died. I almost died! Uh, anyway. Uh, see these, oh, I'm not sure, yeah, I already destroyed this block. Destroy these blocks. All you do is spin jump on them, and ta -da, they're gone. That's about it. <laughs> anyway, those halfway point or these things, they're a halfway point. If you die any part of the level, you'll just respawn there instead of respawning right at the beginning. Yep, explaining stuff. Anyway, these Yoshi coins. Uh, when you get them, you get certain points. Um. Corresponding on how many Yoshi's coins you've got so far. There's five in each level. Uh, getting all five of them will give you a one up. And that's about it. Anyway, watch out for that. Just, just saying. Oh, wow, really? There we go. I don't want to smoke. Anyway, these guys are charging chucks. Well, this is a jumping chuck. But to take them down, all you gotta shoot is five fireballs at them. And wait, actually, go back. I gotta show this too. Hitting that tape will give you certain point, a certain amount of points, depending on how how high you are. Um. When you get a hundred points, you get a bonus game to get like one ups and stuff. Yep, this game gives you a crap load of one ups. And I know that some people, some people say this game is insanely hard. I'm like, uh, not exactly. Although that could be in their opinion. my opinion, this game isn't that hard. Well, once you get into the level, the World 8, yeah, it starts to get hard, but... Not like hard like Kaizo. More... Well, Kaizo was more frustra frustrating than hard, so... That's the thing. Anyway, we just hit the switch, so... All the, uh, invisible yellow... Blocks will be turned into solid blocks. Alright. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention Yoshi's house. Let's just go in it for a second. It's just a screen. This block says... Hello, sorry I'm not home. But I have gone to rescue my friends who were captured by Bowser. Yoshi. Yep, yeah, that's it. Just saying that something happened to him. Anyway, I didn't want to do that. Okay. Yay! Oh wait, I, I got a better idea. Oh, that's gonna catch up. Yep! Oh shoot, I just wanna try and... Oh no. 
What I'm trying to do is, I'm trying to throw the shell. Throw a fireball back. Man. No! Darn it! I can't get this. Alright. Whatever. I'm just gonna keep on running and running and running and running. Actually, I think I can run this map without, like, stopping. I think I've done it before. Oh, wait. I forgot to introduce someone. I'm not sure if I passed him yet, though. Oh, no. Okay, so here's Yoshi. He will basically just let you ride on him. And it creates a really good beat to go with the thing. Anyway, if you get hit with Yoshi on you, uh, Yoshi will start running away. And you'll have to quickly catch him or else he'll fall into a pit or something. Or just keep on going in a circle like that. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, Yoshi can eat things. And eat things. And that's it. At, and Yoshi can do one of those suicidal jumps for him. Uh, which makes you jump farther, but you lose Yoshi. Uh, stupid charging shit. Anyway, 28 points! Uh, I gotta really hurry because... Ah, oh, shit. Shoot. Wait a second, guys. I'll be back. Okay, I'm back, guys. Just random phone calls. Freaking hate when that happens. Anyway, let's go in. Alright, now, this is one of my favorite levels in the game. Mostly because there's tons of those. In this game, this level's fast-paced. And, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> and, because, I, actually, I want to try and find a crap load of coins in this level. What? You'll, you'll see the reason why I want to get a bunch of coins in this level. Oh, wait, there were some back there. Around and around. Who says that I can be possible? Okay, there we go. Alright. So, yay, I'm standing on nothing! Glitches for the win. Glitchers United. No. It's supposed to be Haters United. Alright, then jump it. And, oh, I didn't get 30 coins. Anyway, that block, what it did, what it's supposed to do, is when you get 30 coins in one level, uh, you hit it and you get a 1-up. Anyway, let's just continue. Okay, now we are at Yoshi's Island 4. Let's do this. Anyway, not sure if I even said there's secret pipes in this game. Secret pipes will just lead you nowhere. These are pokies. Uh, basically, Yoshi can eat them up, and he can also, like, do this on top of them. Mostly what they do in Kaizo, but that's, that's all Yoshi really does to pokies. You can't do really get anything to pokies, as you can see. Fireballs don't work. Or you can do the same thing, but with a spin jump. As Yoshi. Anyway. Come here. Oh, by the way, Yoshi does his different things when he sucks up sick different uh, 
Koopa shells. Like, if he eats a red Koopa shell, he shoots fire. Anyway, let's hit this. No, and here's a star. Star is making you invincible, of course, if you've played any other Mario game. You know that. No. Okay, just had to get a life there. Oh, that actually would have sounded weird. Anyway, just do that and 24 points in the bag. Okay, now the first boss castle of the game, Iggy. Basically, you can't take Yoshi into a dungeon or not dungeon tower. I'm just gonna take this P block for no reason. It's gonna burn in the flames. Whoa, that was freaking close. Anyway, let's go down here. Go in the door. And okay, see these things here? Yeah, I just glitched there. If you get hit by them, you're gonna die, basically. Now, a good uh, strategy is to just keep all the way to the right. You won't die. It's like impossible to die. Anyway, this is the first boss of the game, Iggy. He shoots fireballs from his head. And that's all he does. Otherwise, he just has glasses, and there. Okay, so be careful you don't fall in the lava, because you can easily just fall in the lava and die, and, like, have to do that all over again. So, there is the first world done. Mario brings out one of the Yoshi eggs, and he bombs the castle. Mario has defeated the demented Iggy Koopa in castle number one, and rescued Yoshi's friend. He was still trapped in an egg. Together, they now travel to Donut Land. Come on. Okay. So, once you destroy the castle, it does that. And. Wait. If you want to go back into a castle. Wait, I think you can. That's Super Mario Brothers 3. Um, yeah, it might be, like, some other game. Um, anyway, uh, next time, we will be going into World 2, and hopefully finishing it. Uh, so, see you guys later.